Dr. Talk Relief coming up. Well, classroom with no leaders, there's a teacher shortage right now in Ohio, much like the rest of the country. In this News 5 original, Caroline Sweeney shows us the lack of teachers and how it's impacting rural districts. Well, I know we're the smallest school in the Medina County Schools. The Black River Local School District sits on one campus in the middle of Ohio farm country. We are the community, so the school district is the community. It's June and the campus is quiet, but administrators are keeping busy. Here I wear more hats than, than what I would if a counterpart was in a, in a suburban district. Besides being the superintendent, uh, currently my head of maintenance is off, so I am now the head of maintenance for the Black River Local Schools. Clark says doing more than teaching is part of working in a rural district like his. He looks for flexibility with new teacher hires, but recently. You know, there's some conversation about a teacher shortage. That's there. Clark says top teaching candidates go quickly. In Ohio, applicants have a July 10th deadline to accept a job with a district. Four candidates for his district decided to go another way. So we're having to reinvent the wheel as well. So yeah, it makes you very nervous. The Biden administration knows about the teacher shortage. Nine billion dollars proposed in the America's Families Plan would go to train and equip teachers with what they need. Working in a rural district is different. Most of our teachers here when they come out here are not in it for the money. There's some other things that are, that are appealing. 90 miles away in Middlefield. We do have some challenges that maybe more suburban districts do not have to face. Is the Cardinal Local School District. Bill Kermovner says keeping teachers is just as important as finding them. He's worried about new teachers. Everything is under a microscope. Uh, so there's a lot of pressure and, and we see a lot of younger teachers struggling with that right now that may not end up in the profession five years from now. He has enough teachers to cover his classrooms, but not enough substitutes. Just like in Black River, educators in Cardinal Local wear many hats. We're looking for future uh, employees to take on more. Despite that, both Kermovner and Clark say the environment in rural districts is what keeps teachers around. There are a lot of folks out there probably thinking, oh, you're going to some country school. And we, I want to make sure that everybody understands the country schools here can compete. Caroline Sweeney, News 5. Okay, so let's take you in depth now on the extent of the shortage. We're going to start with the jobs in high demand. Ohio's top jobs website shows right now our state needs to fill 3,500 openings for elementary teachers. The median salary for those educators is $63,000. There is another 1,500 teachers needed in preschools and more than 600 kindergarten teachers wanted. Now, even teaching assistants are in high demand right now. And schools are also looking for substitute teachers to fill the gaps. In Ohio, to get a subs license, you must have a bachelor's degree. Contact the district that you wish to work for, complete a background check, and submit an online application. 